Hey Goalie fans, welcome to the video. I'm Juan, I'm 21. I uh, play for FC Barcelona, which is a club you might know. Uh, we have a field hockey team and we play in the first Spanish division. Today I'm going to show you what gear I use, the gear I recommend of course, and also how I set it up inside my bag. Let's check it. I use the Osaka Kai shoes. These are really comfortable shoes, have a good grip and look dope I'd say. So I can ask for anything else. For the back I use the Ovo standard bag. Uh, which gets its name because you can make it stand up and it does before. Of course, let's open it. I have an Osaka stick, it's the Pro Tour 100 mid -pole. I really like uh, player sticks. I feel as it has a bit more weight on the tip, it really gives you an extra power when you touch the ball and it rebounds more. When you're looking for a goalie stick but you also like uh, player sticks, the mid -pole is usually the one that has less of a curve so it's better for saving as when you touch it, it doesn't really change the shape that much and um, you won't get it in front, it just deflects it where you want to. Also, I always like to wear an overgrip to my sticks because it makes me feel I have more control on it. First of all, kickers. These are the Ovo Plus kickers, Robo. Since they changed the model, it's been really an improvement. It doesn't hurt anymore on the tip of your toes which makes a huge difference in being comfortable under the goal. Second, we have the leg guards. These are also the plus ones. Uh, it's a new model they released not long ago. I also feel there's been an improvement, but it's not as noticeable as with the kickers that they, it was a, really a huge step on forward. With this, I, I think it's just better, but I wouldn't say it's a game changer. Of course, I like to keep them the same color, and I chose blue because I like color blue. Next, we have the pants. I use the Ovo Robo ones, the ones that go like this. These are really good pants, what can I say? There's nothing really much to highlight, just really good pants. Groin protection. I use a uh, ice hockey one, because one of my teammates recommended when I was little. Probably now I would switch to the Ovo one, because I think this one is too big for actually what it makes. I think it protects really good, but it just looks like uh, we have too much going, too, too much, uh, going on there. But yeah, ice hockey ground protection, uh, but I would change it to, to the oval, the normal one. That's it. Chest protector, again, the oval robo. I haven't tried any others. It has a good protection on your clavicles, and I've never been hurt with it. Also, it gets uh, really close to your body, which I feel makes it look more aesthetic when you have the shirt on. Okay, guys, the new left hand protector from Obo. Uh, this is a great product. I mean, it lays a bit more forward than the last one from your wrist, which makes you really reach more ball. And it is completely noticeable in practices games. What can I say? I love this glove. I think it's also a game changer just like the kickers. I use this tape here because it gives me extra support in my wrist as it lays a bit forward on your arm. When you save it with the tip, it creates a lot of torsion power, which makes your wrist really go back. And with this extra, you just don't get it that much and you have a bit more control on it. That's why I do it. Uh, you can use it without it. You would save the ball still. But I feel like it gives me a more steady rebound, which I prefer. Okay, right hand protector. I also use the plus one. Uh, I've never tried the one that's closed, so I wouldn't, I cannot give an opinion of which one is better, but I really like this one, gives good mobility. I feel like it won't be also that much noticeable of a difference between the plus one and the old one, because I've actually seen a lot of international goalies that still use the closed one, so maybe they prefer this. Uh, but yeah, it's a good product too. For the elbow protection, I like the oval elbow protectors. Uh, it's not the full arm ones. I feel like the arm ones might get me a bit stiff. So with these ones, it doesn't affect your mobility at all. Well, it protects really your elbow, which is where you can get injured and not feel so confident. So of course you'll get some bruises at your arms, but I mean, that's our job now. So it is what it is. Okay, helmet. I use a nice hockey player helmet with a Verbund case and the Ovo throw protector. It hangs a bit, so I feel 
This is the way it protects your throat the most. And the cage here, yeah, the cage is good. And I've never had any problem with these player helmets as you can regulate how big it is pretty easily with this. Yeah, I really like the helmet. This is the full kit. Thanks to Obo Nasaka for sponsoring me. Because otherwise I wouldn't be able to have this. How to set up my gear in the back? Always I start with leg guards. I do I do it like this. I put them to one of the sides, like that. Then with the kickers, it goes like this. One on top of each other. Then we go with the helmet and the right hand protector, like this. The elbow protectors, one inside the helmet and the other to the other side. Then you have the groin protector, which especially you don't want to get inside your helmet, of course. <laughs> so you put it to the other side. Then you fit your kickers a bit better, so it goes a bit down. And you put the left hand protector on top of the kicker. After that, with my pants like this, I set them up to the bottom of the back. Important tip, the stick always goes on top of your back because you don't want it to get uh, wet and not be able to dry. So when you open your back in your club or at home, it's the first thing you want to keep out of, outside of your back so the grip uh, does dry up. After all, last thing, the chest protector. So you have like this, as you can see, Fits perfectly, and you can close the bag. And that's it. Hope you enjoyed the video. Like, subscribe, comment down below, and remember that you have discount codes on the description. See you until the next video, guys.